Hey guys, welcome to Travel with Austin. I'm Austin, and today is Friday, March 15th, 2019. Um, tomorrow is the day I go and spend the night in the haunted prison. But before I did, I kind of wanted to go over my paranormal gear, I guess you could call it. Um, in my last video, I said I didn't think I'd be able to get a lot of things, but it turns out I actually had a good amount of stuff, and I did find some things. So, first of all, obviously, I'm going to have my camera with me. Um, it's not in its case right now because I'm using it to film this. Now, next, I'm going to have a series of different lights. Um, I have my trusty lantern, which has a few different modes that you can activate, and it can also charge your phone. So, I'm bringing that with me. Um, I also found this LED flashlight at Dollar Tree and also an LED headlamp. Um, so these are just some extra light sources for me to have. Um, so I am bringing two power banks. This is the smaller one, so I can use it to charge devices when I'm walking around. So if I, like, need to charge my camera up, I can just fit this in my pocket. Then also I have a bigger 20,000 milliamp, um, power bank for charging my phones and stuff. And if I absolutely need to, this has a 10,000 milliamp, um, power bank inside of it that I can use. Now, also, I might bring this laser pointer. Um, I'm not really sure if it would be allowed or not. But with this attachment, it does kind of make like a grid that you can use to like see if something's moving in the grid. Um, but I'm not really sure if I am going to bring it. Then I also picked this up for about 10 bucks off Amazon. Now, this is an infrared um, thermometer. And it basically will just tell you the temperature with a little laser. So you can see there's the laser. And the temperature right there is 61. Now you can also turn off the laser. So it will still tell you the temperature. But like it won't show the laser. Um, so I can really use this. if See if there's like a cold spot. I'm not sure how accurate it is. Because it was 10 bucks. However as long as it could tell like significant differences in temperature. It would work for me. And also it was pretty pretty neat. Um, so of course I will have my phone. I really wanted to get a digital recorder. But they were all. Like they started out around 30 bucks. So I couldn't get one of those. So I'm going to bring my phone. And probably a few old phones. That I could leave around as. Um, recorders. To see if I can hear any voices or anything. I also have this camera that I'm using right now. Um, like it caught a bunch of noises in the haunted hospital. So maybe we can catch something with this. And then this isn't really ghost hunting gear. However, I did just buy a black light. And I'm planning on bringing that with me. So I can see if the prison's nasty or not. Which I imagine it probably is. Um... So this is really all my ghost hunting gear that I'm going to have with me. I honestly think this camera and my phone will probably be the best chance I have of catching anything. Um, mainly just because of the audio. But I am excited to test out this temp gun just to see if um, it can register different temperatures. And it, it can register like drops in temperatures. And one other thing I might try to find is a compass. Um, I did watch a YouTube video about cheap ghost hunting gear. So I could have stuff for this trip. And they did say that if you get a compass, it can act the same way as an EMF detector. Um, so I may bring one of those, but I haven't found one yet. So anyway, this is all my ghost hunting gear that I'm bringing with me. I'm also obviously going to have my um, DSLR camera with me and I sadly can't bring my drone because there is a working prison behind this prison um so this is everything I have I hope you guys like this video um the video is actually inside the prison so just start showing up within a day or two so thank you guys for watching and goodbye